since I was really young, probably about five years old, but I started getting back into painting recently after finishing um, my degree in biology. Basically, I go in um, without any sort of direction or any sort of predisposition as to what I want to do. I just put on some music, go into the studio, pick some colors, and just kind of go for it and, and use the flexibility and the creativity that comes to me along the way to navigate the painting. I really don't go in with any sort of sense of direction or bearings. I just go for it. A lot of my inspiration actually comes from what I studied, which is science which I once thought to be such a concrete subject, but as I started studying it, I realized it was probably the most abstract thing I could study because nothing in science is absolute. That's the only thing that absolute is, is that nothing is absolute, and that in itself actually inspires me, and that's why I do abstracts because you kind of just go with it along the way, and you create the composition along the way, create the colors and the, the theme, and you have to be okay with, with changing from where you originally started, and it's kind of the same process that you see in a lab or, or in research, which is really cool to me, so that process itself actually is what creatively inspires me to do abstract. I've always made it my own personal goal to be able to do both art and science, and one of my short-term goals is to be able to show people that you can do both and you can follow both careers and my long-term goal is obviously to become a physician. I'm going to medical school in the fall and to keep art as such an important part of my life and to use art as a vehicle of education to the public um, for any type of medical thing or scientific thing just to get people involved in a different way. So that's my unique kind of goal for the long term. In five years, you're gonna see plenty of canvases all around people's homes, hopefully, or places of work. And um, hopefully I'll be finished with medical school and also my art will be taking off even further, hopefully. To find out more information about me and my work, you can go to my website, which is www.gabriellaperez Abstract Art with one L. And from there, you can find the links to all my social media, my Facebook, my Instagram, and all that. My name is Gabby, and I'm a raw artist.